Creating animated explainer videos usually takes a lot of time. Writing scripts, recording voiceovers, designing visuals, and syncing everything perfectly. And if you're not a designer, this process can feel overwhelming and expensive. But what if you could turn a simple prompt, document, or even your own voiceover into a fully animated whiteboard video automatically? In this video, I'll show you how Golpo AI makes that possible in just a few clicks. This is Parvez Durrani and you are watching Guru Tech Solutions. First, we'll search for Golpo AI in our browser and click on the very first result. Once we land on the main website of Golpo AI, you'll see that it allows you to easily convert your documents into whiteboard-style animated videos. To get started, simply click on the Getting Started option. From here, you can log in using your Google account or your Microsoft account. So let's log in. After logging in, you'll be taken to the main interface of Golpo AI, which looks something like this. Here, you can enter your prompt, and just below that, you have the option to upload PDF or DOCX files. You can also upload videos and images. Additionally, you'll find options to add specific instructions such as voice accents and visual guidelines. These are part of the advanced settings. Now let's begin by entering our prompt. We've prepared a detailed prompt that says, create a short explainer video showing how a poor AI prompt leads to weak results and how clear, detailed prompts improve output. Start with visuals of confusion and low-quality AI responses caused by weak prompts. Then transition to structured prompts with clear goals, tone, and context, showing better and more accurate results. Use simple animations, clean text highlights, smooth transitions, and maintain a professional educational style, reinforcing the message that better prompts create better AI results. Once the prompt is ready, the next step is to upload a reference video. This is the video we want to include in our final animated output. You can also describe how this media should appear in the video. For example, we'll write use as reference. By doing this, Golpo AI will try to maintain a similar animated character or visual style in the final video. For audio, you can either use the original audio from the uploaded video or select an AI-generated voice. In the voice instructions, you can choose accents and define visuals, but for now, we'll keep these sections empty to give the AI more creative freedom. Next, we'll enable Edit the Script before creating, so Golpo AI will generate a script first and allow us to review it. We'll also select the color option to generate a colorful video instead of a black and white one. For the duration, we'll choose 30 seconds, select default engaging music, and choose a male voice. The orientation will be set to horizontal, the language will be selected accordingly, and for the style, we'll choose the improved beta version. If you have a brand or company logo, you can upload it here as well. Now, we'll click on Generate Script and Golpo AI will create a script based on our prompt. Once the script is ready, you can review it and make any changes, such as shortening it or adding more details. When everything looks good, simply click on Create Video from Script and Golpo AI will start generating your final animated video. Once the video is ready, we can simply click on the play button and open it in full AI screen view. Tell you about cats, Here you can clearly see the final result. Overview. Let's watch you the video ask it to first. Explain blockchain and you get a wall of technical jargon that's impossible to understand. The problem in most cases isn't the AI. It's the instruction. Vague prompts lead to vague, low quality and sometimes completely irrelevant results. But crafting a clear, detailed prompt can transform that output from useless to indispensable. It boils down to a few core principles. Think of it as giving the AI a perfect recipe instead of just a list of ingredients. First, be incredibly specific and clear. Don't just say, explain hand washing. Instead, say, write a message for primary school teachers to explain to young children why hand washing is important using friendly language. Second, provide context. Who is this for? What is the goal? 
defining the audience and purpose is crucial. Third, define the desired tone. For more complex tasks, you can take it a step further. Instruct the AI to think step by step. This method, called chain of thought prompting, encourages the model to break down a problem and sh As you can see, we added a reference video and Golpo AI successfully used it and integrated it into the final animated output. The AI matched the visual style and blended it smoothly with the animation, making the video look very engaging and professional. So what do you think about this result? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Now let's move on to our second video. In this second part, you can see that we've prepared a detailed voiceover narration. What we'll do next is copy this narration and head over to Eleven Labs. First, search for Eleven Labs, then open it and go to Text to Speech. Here, we'll paste our copied voiceover script and generate the speech. Once the voiceover is generated, let's play it and review the output. Have you ever wondered why AI sometimes gives average, confusing, or com After that, we'll download the generated audio and return back to Golpo AI to use this custom voiceover in our video. Here, we'll select the Own Narration option. As soon as we select it, you'll see a new interface appear. In this section, you can upload an audio file, a video file, or even record your own voice and use it as the source to create a fully animated video. Since we already generated our narration using Eleven Labs, we'll upload that audio file here. After uploading the audio, the next step is to select the verification checkbox. By selecting this option, we confirm that we are the rightful owner of the uploaded content or that we have explicit permission to use it and that it complies with all applicable laws and third-party rights. Now, let's move to the prompt section. Here, we'll enter a short prompt to guide the AI in creating the visuals. For example, show graphs and charts where needed using smooth transitions in a clean educational style. Once the prompt is ready, we'll scroll down and select the color option, which will generate a colorful video instead of a black and white one. Below this, you'll notice that the custom duration option is disabled. That's because Golpo AI automatically matches the video length to the uploaded audio narration. We'll keep the music and voice settings on default and set the orientation to vertical. After finalizing all the settings, we'll click on Generate Video. Here, you'll also see an option to make this video public in the Golpo library, which is coming soon. We'll enable this option and let the AI start generating our final video. Once the video is ready, we can open it in full screen view and play it. Wondered why AI sometimes gives average, confusing, or completely off-topic results, even though it's supposed to be powerful? Most people blame the tool, but the real problem is how we give prompts. When prompts are short, vague, or unclear, the AI has no idea what we actually want, so the output feels generic and disappointing. This wastes time and makes AI look less useful than it really is. The truth is, AI works best when it's given clear instructions. When you explain your goal, your audience, the format you want, and the tone you're expecting, the result and just like that, using only a single audio narration and a simple prompt, Golpo AI creates a complete animated video with visuals that perfectly match the voiceover. The results are clean, engaging, and surprisingly accurate. So, what do you think about this tool? I'll put the link in the description. Check it out and share your thoughts in the comments. That's it for this complete video on Golpo AI. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more videos like this in the future.